We have seen in previous lessons how arrays are used to store multiple values of the similar data type. Now in this video we will talk about how arrays can also be used to store multiple objects of the same class. An array of objects is created just like an array of primitive type data items in the following way. The student objects have to be instantiated using the constructor of the student class and their references should be assigned to the array elements in the following way. Now a statement like this would initialize the marks value to the first element of the array as 100. Though it's a two-step process that you have to create the array and then you have to create the objects that need to be placed in all the array positions, object arrays are still really important while coding in Java.